Hello, welcome to Road to A Plus. I'm Rochakta Sandhuni, and today's lesson is Grade Ten English, Unit Two, On Your Way. So I know most of y'all are really, really, really lazy and bored at home. So in this lesson, what we will be doing is we will be seeing how we can get along in places. On your way, kyaane apni kohe yari yana gama. So this is going to be a little journey for all of us, just to take a break from all the home activities we've been doing. So let's get into the lesson. As you can see, this is the first page. So we'll be moving on to the activities in the textbook and the workbook as well. So let's start with role play. So in the previous lesson also we read it together. So make a tapi ekata karmo. Metna characters then ne kinnama Arjun and Banuka. So let's read. Arjun says, "Excuse me, Banuka." Yes, what can I do for you? Arjun, can you please tell me where I can have a cup of tea? Banuka, sure, you can try Leaf Cafe. Arjun, Leaf Cafe? Where is it? Banuka, it is on First Cross Street. Arjun, okay, how do I get there? Banuka, this is Main Street. Api dang in the Main Street again. Arjun, hmm, Main Street. Okay. Banuka, walk along this street. Turn left to First Cross Street. Leaf Cafe is the second building on your left. The first building is the pharmacy. Arjun. Are there any landmarks, Banka? Well, when you walk along this street, you will pass the National Bank and the theater on your right. Then there is a communication center next to the cafe. Arjun, did you say that I will pass the National Bank and the theater on my right, and the cafe is between the pharmacy and the communication center, Banka? That's right. You have got it. Arjun, thank you very much. Banuka, my pleasure. Now, what we were listening to was a conversation. Yalu o denek ne me pare yano kote Arjun te denagan none leaf cafe ekre yano puluan de kela. Eke ne yato te kak bono one kohinte mangye te kak bono one na kohinte yano ne kela me ahuwa. Banuka kiwa leaf cafe ekin kela. Then Arjun Danne leaf cafe ka kohi the tien ne kiya. So Banuka was giving directions to Arjun. So me bage apita koi hari yanno one na thena kohi the tien ne kiya Danne na tang. Ega kohamat ahan ne na tang e thena tien na thena Danne vanang thava kine ekta kiya ne kohamat kiya me lesson ne kiya apit gina ganwa. So. Then Banuka, I, I just want you to see how Banuka tells Arjun where it is. Ya hamet de ma kiya na landmarks ko hede thi ne kila kiya na road names ut kiya na. So let's look at them first. Banuka says that this leaf cafe is on First Cross Street. Then Arjun is probably wondering First Cross Street ki thi ne ko hede kiya na First Cross Street is where. You turn left to First Cross Street, and it's near Main Street. And where is Leaf Cafe? The second building on your left. The first building is the pharmacy. Then he asks for landmarks. You all know what landmarks are. So when you are looking for a place, ko hari andu na na thena ti no the kila ahanwa. Samara khatte kyo na boga hing vamata haravan na. Like that, light canoeing, Vamata Harvana, Vamata Harvana. Those are the landmarks that we say. So here, what he is saying is, there is a national bank and a communication center, which are the landmarks, as well as a theater. So communication center is next to cafe. Is eka alla po the ni communication center ka. So let's go on. Now we identify where exactly this uh, cafe is. Now in your workbook, 
there is a map workbook ke okay? map ekak diila thiyenawa so let's go on to the activity now before that um i want you all to know that there are a few things that we identified uh katha karana kota meva thamai qa what did you say excuse me kelimma kenekta gihila katha karanna naha it's disrespectful so what you say is you first say excuse me ona da kat aha ganna one na or you want to talk to someone you first start by saying excuse me meka wenne thawa denne katha karana kota oyatat katha karanna one na madata paninne nathuwa first you say excuse me and then you start your conversation so the next one is what can i do for you now meva okkuma katha karana bhashaving thamai kiyanne but it is more polite right what can i do for you next one is sure that's right you have got it that's right you have got it now you have got it eke therum dekak thiyena so you have got it kiyanne ata eka hambuna but here eka singalen kiyuwa deka a harita hari that is what they are meaning that is right you have got it ah right hari eta hari so next one is my pleasure my pleasure is another way of saying you're welcome so these are the few things that you all need to know so so when you are talking to other people you can use this so you can start a conversation if without immediately going into it you can start by saying excuse me and when you are done when someone says thank you you can say either you're welcome or my pleasure so the next one is they say to draw a sketch of this map on your uh, book so here you have a very beautiful map that is drawn ඕගලන්ට කරන්න තියෙන්නේ ඒකෙන් ස්කෙච් එක ගහ ගන්න විතරයි. පාට් වල දාන්න ඕනේ නෑ. That is your choice. Uh, label the buildings on the map. ඒකෙන් නම් කරන්න ඕනේ. And mark leaf cafe on your map. So let's do this together. Now let's just go through the conversation that we had. Now මේක කරන්න නම් we have to remember what we uh red before so i have just put them here as you can see so the first one is now we are going to identify where leaf cafe is leaf cafe ga kohida thiyenna kiyala bala ganna one then metana me map eke e label karala naha habai banuka kiyapu wachana walin apita dana ganna puluwan kohida leaf cafe ga thiyenna kiyala so banuka says walk along this street turn to turn left to first cross street now map ke balana kota you can see first cross street right you will see it and you also see main street right then banuka says leaf cafe is the second building on your left the first building is the pharmacy now you know left and right vama dakuna second building devani building eka right so we'll look at first cross street when you look at first cross street you will see the first building is supposed to be the pharmacy second building on your left vam pattata thiyena devani building eka thamai leaf cafe eka then he also says when you walk along this street this street kiyane first cross street eka you will pass the national bank and the theater on your right then there is a communication center next to the cafe so now we'll go and see how we can label this so banuka qa main street taking gihilla first cross street ekata yanna kiyala then first cross street ekata gihama etana thiyena pharmacy eka kohida thiyenne he said leaf cafe is the second building to the left the first building is the pharmacy e kiyanne meka pharmacy eka So if that is the pharmacy, Leaf Cafe is the second building. There are many building aga on your uh, left, one path that is. That is Leaf Cafe. Now we identified where Leaf Cafe is. Let's see the other buildings. We have the National Theater, uh, National Bank, sorry, and the theater, and then we also have the Communication Center. So the National Theater, National Bank, and the theater is on your right. Sorry. National Theatre and the bank is on your right. 
and you have the communication center next to the cafe. I haven't, mama label color nahan. I want you all to do this on your own. Then leaf cafe ka langa mati in the building ka thamai communication center ka. National bank and theater ka is on the right. A national bank ka palavinate ka kiapu nisa. First ka thamai national bank ka ka to piti pasa tiyane theater ka. Right, I hope you all got that together. Um, so let's move on to the next one. Identify the places and signs on the map given below and write the name of each place against the number given. Now signs, we all know signs. When you're walking on the road, you will see so many signs. You see the stop sign, you see the sign for the hospital, the railroad, and you see the uh, crossing as well. Then methana signs tick up the So for an example, uh, you will know that it's for tea, right? So let's move on to uh, our activity. These are the answers that I have. Let's see how we came to this. So, right, let's go to the first one, tea shop that they have given. Number one, you see it's a tea cup. So therefore, it's a tea shop. Now, number two, I didn't go to Mama... Um, Islama answer sticker pen away because I wanted to show how I came to those answers, right? So let's go one by one. So number two. Number two is very tricky to look at a bit uh, closer. Uh, since y'all have the workbook and the textbook with y'all, I suggest that y'all don't look at my screen, but y'all look at your textbook, right? So you look a bit closer and you see, what is it? It's a post box. And Lankave eva gave a hair. But uh, that is how a post box, post box looks like, right? Uh, so then we go to number three, which is a hotel. How did we come to that conclusion? It's a hotel. So that means so it's not a restaurant, but it's a big building. So it is a hotel. So next one is the post office. Post office se ka kiwa ma olwata enne mukadda. A letter and an envelope. Liyum cover yakne thi enne. So that means that is a post office. So just like this, you can see that the signs are what give us the name of that thing. Thing or place. So then we go to five. Hospital. Now hospital kiwa ma you will think of the Red Cross, right? Hospital starts with which letter? H, right? So look at number five. It says H. So it is a hospital. Don't mix it up with anything else. Just remember it's a hospital. Or exam meke meva ge deak dunnot, it's a hospital. Natang red cross se kak dunnot, that can also go as a hospital uh, if you want it to be a hospital. So uh, let's go on to the next one. Six, railway station. How did I come to the railway station? I have a sign that 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 I Bank would have a key and a quarter, all what any mukad, a bank would give a mukad the karane. A bank would can in a henny, we go there to deposit money, sally. So when you think of money, what is the sign we have? It's a tiny dollar bill, the kagan in Lankave, Rupila Dal and a hair, but they put the dollar bill there and the um, coins as well. So you will see that that is a bank. Cartoon Sulat Dakaratina Neda Mukakari Saliga and Kataka Nukota, a sign Nakatamai N. So that is a bank. Then we come to eight park. That is a bit tricky. Now we have Bihar Mahadevi Park. And how we do how do we know that it's a park? Because Ape Amala Tata Kilatina, that is a park killer. But when you look at it, you can see a lake, you can see some trees. So it can't be a forest or anything like that. Because why? Eka nagareka tiyenne. So nagareka eva ke tenak tiyeno kiyanne eka park ekak. So I labeled it as the park. 
Then we come to number nine, car park. Now car park is very easy because when you think of a car park, it is where vehicles are. Now you see number nine, it has the vehicles and it has the sign P. P means car park, right? Then we have 10, theater. Theater is where we go to watch movies, right? Now those days, Paranakalidi, Oyavage symbol lekakti, you know, that is the uh, very old, uh, very old uh, version of a camera or a movie reel, right? Then Kali over Pavachikara Nenehe, but um, normally theater gana, theater ka gana katakarana koto, Oyavage symbol lekakta mai Pavachikara ne. Okay, that's not a camera, that is something where you put the movie reel and uh, that movie plays on the screen in front. So that is the theater. Right? Then we move on to the last one, the supermarket. Now the supermarket, when we go in, what's the first thing we take? We take a trolley, right? Or a bag, but here they have the trolley. So the trolley means that is a supermarket. So looking at all of this, the reason I showed you all the answers first was to make sure that you all know why I came to that conclusion. So let's go through that a few more times. Uh, so the teacup, it's a tea shop. Why? Because of the cup and the saucer, right? Just like that, so many other things have symbols. Trikka katama e symbol eka deha balala eking uttara ganna. You can't just take it at once, right? Why exam eka kada aba nang? The trick is to look at the symbol and eka vatte tiene eva building eka dia balana. The symbol also because railway station eki apne the symbol eka tibre ne hani. Railway track kai, uh, train kai. So that is how we realized it is a railway. Same comes to the park, right? So let's move on to the next one. That is true or false, right? So let's go back to the map and see what it is. The monkey won a park forest. It's can't, it can't be a forest. Typically speaking. So, therefore, this place is a town, a city, right? So, because it says town square, town street. So, those are your little hints. Hamatisima paper came, Mukakari hint, Tekak deno Ogolanta. So, this says town street, town square. So, take that into your head. So, let's go to the uh, activity. This is a picture of a city. Is it a picture of a city? Is it a picture of a village? No, right? It's a picture of a city, so it's true. There is a lot of traffic on the roads. Hmm, let's go back and see. Was there traffic on the roads? Traffic means a lot of cars. Cars go dark, so that means that is false, right? The hotel is in front of the bank. Now, I'm not going to go back. I can. Um, I'm not going to go back. Uh, so just look at your textbook and see, is the hotel in front of the bank? Right? Hotel is bank. I'll give you a few minutes. It's false. It's not. It's next to it. Right? If you look at it, I will go back and show you. It's next to it. Number seven. Right? It's next to it. It's actually, yeah, it's next to it. Eka hospital like the Pitipasati, and the hotel is just just next to it, right? So let's go on to the next one. Um, right, there are many trees behind the cinema. Were there many trees behind the cinema? Just look. Gastikakti, you know, the gas godakti, you know, the many means a lot. Gas godakti, you know, the cinema, ekalanga. cinema is again the theater, right? So cinema ekata godak nam thena. We can call it the movie theater, the theater and the cinema, right? There are many trees behind the cinema. Are there many trees behind the cinema? No, so it's false. The hotel is on the right hand side of the car park. Hotel etienne, right hand side of the car park. Right means what? Vama dakuna, dakuna petta. Of the car park. Just go back and check. So remember the words hotel, right hand side, and car park. It's false. 
there is a car park next to the railway station car park එක කොහෙද තියෙන්නේ ඒක railway station එක ගාවද තියෙන්නේ yes it was the cinema is in the new market street now this is a new one we didn't know what this new market street was right let's go back and see you see the new market street there just observe it let's go back to the question now the cinema is in the new market street is it what did you see yes it is in the new market street now we spoke about where places are now signs and objects are can be the same so now where a person is standing a kohe the inne kela kya nona na this is how we say it we use prepositions prepositions are the relationship between a person and an object or two people or two objects um object ekha sambal thavayak thiyenawa thava kenekt ekka so if you are going to say so i am next to a door next to is the preposition next to is the preposition so mage sambal thave is with this door right so let's look at the relationship between the ball and the box right e athara thina sambandha thave mukadda kiyala balamu kohomada me sambandha thave hedala thiyenne right so where is the ball is the question right so again i have given you all the answers because i want to explain to you all how i came to the answers right so the first one the ball and the box now the where is the ball ball e athule neda thiyenne so that means it's in next one again we come to left and right it is on the left side the next one it's on the other side so it's on the right next you come to the other one now that is also on the right but since we have used uh, the words on the right let's go for a different one here it is the ball is next to the box ball is next to the box eka langa thiyenne ball e box eka langa thiyenne right then we go to the next one eka piti passe thiyenne piti passe thiyenawa nan piti passe thiyenawa nan it's behind so this door is behind me sambandha thave mukadda me dora mage piti passe thiyenne it's behind me so that ball is behind the box then confused when the pa hama thisna prashne pattare kiyawana kota hondata kiyawanna because they ask where is the ball right so prashna pattare ahai where is a particular object a particular object ekka issala honduna ganna one honduna gattata passe anith me answers walta prashna walta uttara denna puluwan right so we are going to focus on the ball right So last one, where is it? Where is the ball? The ball is in front of the box, right? So let's go through that again. Now we are going to focus on the ball, right? Why are we focusing on the ball? Because they are asking where is the ball. So first one, where is the ball? It's inside. Next one, it's on the left. The ball is on the left. from the box next one on the right the other one now why did we say that this is next to it because we have actually used the others ek lang thiyenne lang thiyenne because it's really close now if you look at the others on the left and on the right ek athara podi distance ekak thiyenawa right but this one when you say next to it's very close lang thiyenne so you have the box then you have the ball right here the other one of course it's behind and the other one is in front so these are the prepositions you can use so it doesn't apply to just a ball so example i am taking this door right behind me so if i was to talk about the relationship between the door and me i would say the door is behind me now prashna patre ahuot now if this is a picture of me prashna patre ahuot dora kohede thiyenne kiyala where is the door you would say the door is behind the girl right 
and if they ask where is the girl you would say the door the girl is in front of the door the girl is in front of the door always use the object they are asking right so that actually comes to the end of my presentation as in uh, the lesson for today so next week we'll be learning about collective nouns right so best thing to do to practice this is to take an object and see where the, it is placed also when you're going on the road just see how people give you directions right when you're going on the road people may ask you how do you go to this place so you will practice and learn uh, how to give directions by uh, practicing the few activities that we have done so until then stay safe and take care